most exciting part for me was when we got to investigate with the different kinds of mangoes with the magnifying glass. I saw like each fiber and the roots, and then I got to see like the little bumps in the salt. It was really cool, and the wax. The seedlings, when they're ready, this, this part will drop off of it, and this will go up inside the water. How they travel and like sink down in the ground, that makes me think that the plants have like a brain themselves to just know when to stick down to the ground. Well, my dad is very smart and his parents always used to talk to him about the ocean and the marine life. And he wants me to be someone that could improve the world. And I want to start that off by the mangroves in the ocean. So CUC is very happy to have been sponsoring the mangrove tour program for the last 20 years. Um, it gives students who are across Grand Cayman the opportunity to go out and see what a beautiful island that we live on. CUC sponsoring us for that long, it's been really exciting because they're not thinking short term, they're thinking long term, they're thinking how important this kind of education is on a long term basis for young people and ultimately for when they become parents and grandparents down the road. It has a huge impact on their lives and on their family lives. So today I saw different species of mangroves and also I saw starfish, um, seagrass and a lot more. We went to the Central Wetland Mangroves to learn all about mangroves. To animals, mangroves provide food, shelter, and, and animals can lay their eggs there just in case prey comes to come eat them. So by educating the kids on the importance of the wetlands and the mangroves and how the ecosystem interacts with the entire Cayman, um, it gives them an opportunity that when they become older that they'll know the importance. So when these young people that we had on the boat today, when they become our future premier, the future ministry for environment, the future minister for planning, they'll remember that yes, it's important for us to take care of our natural environment and do what they can to ensure that this experience that they had when they were kids can be passed on to their kids as well. So the fundamental idea behind teaching a program like this is, is not only to have the students get an essential understanding of the ecology uh, of mangrove ecosystems, but also how they interrelate to the ecosystems where they live and what impact they might have on their lives because particularly these days Grand Cayman is getting more and more urbanized and so there seems to be less and less contact with young people with a natural environment. I really think that Cayman should preserve more mangroves and start growing them to protect us from further hurricanes, tornadoes and storms so we don't take as much damage. Because the last time it happened, Cayman was about 90% flooded. So I think it should be so we can be safer.